Tonight on the Entertainment Report, the baby boom at the movies continues with more diaper humor in Three Men and a Baby. That review after today's trivia question. How many times was Arnold Schwarzenegger named Mr. Olympia? Have you noticed that babies are currently in vogue in both the movies and television? The yuppie generation has discovered parenthood and it's bringing big business to the box office. The latest is a foray into fatherhood called Three Men and a Baby. It stars Tom Selleck, Ted Danson, and Steve Gutenberg as three swinging bachelors with an allergic reaction to responsibility and commitment. <laughs> That's a baby. Oh, I know it's a baby. <laughs> What's it doing there? It's sleeping. Oh, okay. <laughs> Who do you suppose it belongs to? Oh, Peter, there's a little note. Three Men and a Baby takes a hilarious look at the changes that a baby brings to one's life, especially to those who weren't prepared for it. The story comes from the 1985 French film Three Men and a Cradle, and the American version, which was directed, by the way, by Leonard Nimoy, Mr. Spock, is a bigger and more colorful movie. Do, do, do. Good night, sweetheart. Well, it's time to go. Do, 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 do. I hate hey. to leave you, but I really must say good night, sweetheart. Good night. Three Men and a Baby is as smooth and frothy as a milkshake. W.C. Fields would no doubt hate it. But anyone who is a parent will find that there's an authentic ring behind all those baby jokes. Some people were surprised over the weekend when they were charged $6.50 instead of $6 to see a movie. Famous Players, one of the two major movie distributors in Canada, is adding half a dollar to their admission price. And the first movie to be affected is Barbara Streisand's Nuts. Isn't it funny how the prices always seem to go up when all the Christmas movies are being released? The Olympic Arts Festival has finally divulged the names of the artists who will be performing at the Olympic Folk Festival. That's on January 27th. The list includes John Allen Cameron, Margaret Crystal, Valdi, and Spirit of the West. In trivia today, the question was, how many Mr. Olympia titles has Arnold Schwarzenegger won? The answer is an unprecedented seven times. Arnold's new movie, The Running Man, is doing very well at the theaters. For the Entertainment Report, I'm Jamie Wall.